Hello and welcome to the virtual open evening for the Langton Mathematics Department. My name is Dr Towler and as Deputy Subject Leader of this department I would like to take you through what you can expect from us. Mathematics is a creative and highly interconnected discipline that has been developed over centuries, providing the solution to some of history's most intriguing problems. It is essential to everyday life, critical to science, technology and engineering, and necessary for financial literacy and most forms of employment. A high quality mathematics education therefore provides a foundation for understanding the world, the ability to reason mathematically, an appreciation of the beauty and power of mathematics, and a sense of enjoyment and curiosity about the subject. In Key Stage 3, which is years 7 to 9, we teach our students to develop fluency, reason mathematically, and solve problems. The way we structure our lesson accounts for all levels of ability. For each unit of work we follow a step-by-step -step process which has the following stages master, check, strengthen or extend and finally test. The bulk of the lessons for each unit are in the master phase during which we teach the fundamental knowledge and skills and the students are given time to practice questions designed to consolidate their learning. Then we have a check-up lesson, during which the students independently complete a series of questions across the whole unit, which is effectively a short formative assessment that will give them an indication of their confidence level and inform their next decision about how best to prepare for the test. Based on the outcome of the check-up, the students will then complete a strengthen exercise to build confidence or work on extension questions which will increase the breadth and depth of their understanding. The unit then ends with a formal test during a lesson which will be used to inform projected grades and report grades over the year. Each year in Key Stage 3 the students will study approximately 10 units. In Year 7, students can expect to study the four operations, negative numbers and powers, graphs, charts and averages, expressions, formulae and equations, fractions, decimals, percentages, uh, ratio and proportion, perimeter, area and volume, and sequences and algebraic graphs. As you can see, the students are exposed to a wide range of areas across mathematics, all of which is revisited and built upon over the years as new topics are introduced. When the boys join the school, they are not placed in sets for mathematics in the first year. By the end of year seven, we will have collected an, a significant amount of data on each student, which along with the teacher's experiences of the students in class, will be used to make a decision on the best set for the student to enter, which will then be reassessed every year from years 8 to 11. Now we will have a look in the exercise books of some students across years 7 and 8. As you can see, the boys take notes in lessons and they are encouraged to keep their notes neat and well presented. It is very important that the students learn to lay out their working in mathematics and this is constantly encouraged because the working is as important, if not more important, than the answer itself. In the maths department, we have 11 mathematics specialist teachers. Mrs. Thompson is our subject leader, Dr. Towler, myself, Deputy Subject Leader, and then we have Mr. Davis, Mrs. Wells, Mr. Waters, Mr. Plum, Miss Keeler, Mrs. Stally, Mr. Eagle, Miss Berry, and Mr. George. Together we have well over 150 years experience teaching mathematics. Every member of our department is incredibly passionate and we all thoroughly enjoy our jobs. We understand the importance of being approachable and creating a safe environment in our lessons where students are not afraid of making mistakes and value the input of others. We are always excited about meeting the next cohort of Langton students and on that note I hope to see some of you next September. One last thing before we finish. Usually, when we have our open evening, we operate two competitions for the Year Sixes. Um, we do not want to let the pandemic stop this from happening. So I have set up a Google form in which you can still enter this competition and be in with a chance of winning either a £10 Amazon voucher or a scientific calculator. You should see on the screen now the URL for the Google form you will need to enter into your browser so that you can enter the competition. Please enter your name, your school and your email address at the top of the form before then entering your answers to the two sections of the competition. We will be in contact a few weeks after this goes out to let you know who has won. Good luck!